Welcome back! This is Arcade Night, and we have our sights set on the town of Darim. And the Lieutenant Colonel is going all in for the final battle. So sit back on your comfy chairs, grab a golden canteen of your favorite tasty beverage as we get ready to play the Parabellum. We got a lot of recruiting to do if we expect to fill back up second company. So let's recruit some volunteers from some Nord territories. Let's see, how what did they do for us? That got us pretty close. That's perfect. So we got them. Let's put them into second company. Uh, join all the rest of these men. Yes, yeah, second company. Now uh, we got you in first company. Let's see what first company is looking like after that last battle. Yes, first company's got 17... Alright, first company's looking pretty good, actually. Okay. So I, I feel pretty good about that. And I still have plenty of room to pick up some more tanks. I'd like to get back up to, to uh, any four more tanks. That's 20,000. That's more than 20,000. I think that's 24,000. And if we want to get hmm, maybe one more camel fighter, one more bomber, that's going to cost us a little bit too. So we've got a lot to do. Plus, let, let's go over to, hmm, how about Sarkov? And we're going to see if we could buy a new machine gun, too. Because Lieutenant Colonel's not happy with his, his weapon. It hasn't been performing like he'd hoped. So let's see what our options here in Sargoth. We go to the marketplace. Uh, yes. The, okay. So this one looks promising. Speed rating is much slower, though. Ah, you see, I think I may get this, this automatic rifle. The speed rating's much faster... The damage is the same. Yeah, I think I may. And I think I think I was doing much better with this one. Yeah. And then I could possibly give this to one of my... Maybe Sergeant Buckles? Maybe Lieutenant uh, Wellborn? Perhaps? And then let's get some more grenades. Because uh, I think last time... We, were, we, we had a problem. Uh, our good doctor didn't have the proper grenades. He had uh, tank grenades, which... Perhaps I should carry some, but no, nah, I think I think it's, this is best. Okay, so we've spent, ooh, six thousand. Hmm. That's okay. That's okay. All right, let's go ahead and uh, make sure we've got everything properly. So yes, good. Um, Ira, what what are you carrying? Uh, let's talk to you about your equipment. So you've got this accuracy fifty-five. What if I gave you that? Ah, perfect. And you're you're good with your grenades. Frank Buckles, let's talk to you. So you've got the automatic. Okay, good, good. And you've got a bunch of grenades instead of stick grenades. So that's fine. You can blow up some tanks. But the good doctor, the good doctor, I think I gave you nothing but. That's not what we need to do. I think I'll give you nothing but. Yeah. I'll give you stick grenades. And you've got the automatic rifle and you've got the Winchester. So I think we're all good. Speed rating 80, though. Ooh, damage 50. Accuracy is a lot less, too. So I think I think we're doing good. We're doing good. That's what we're going to do. We're going to keep it like that. And um, so we're going to bring these Nord volunteers up, too. Because we want to upgrade them as soon as possible. I think what we need to also do... How much is our weekly cost? 3,000. Right, it's cutting really close. Maybe we could... Buy while we're here. Maybe huh, another tank. I think so. Buy one more tank. And then what we're also going to do is I'm, I'm going to head back to Reblip and make sure that we've got all of our tanks, all of our fighters, and all of our bombers. And uh, before we we head to the rim and, and try to take it. So I'll see you guys in a second. Well, nothing too impressive in our garrison. Exactly what I thought. We need to keep those men there. In fact, we probably need to rebuild it soon. However, our favorite village that we love to raid time and time again is wide open. Let's do it and burn it. Let's see if you can buy us a couple of tanks. Poor, poor villagers. Alright, what do we get? That was quick. Oh, yes! Magnificent! Look at the wine and vodka and... Syrup, rum. Hmm. I think I think the good lieutenant colonel's gonna keep a little bit of rum, and he's gonna 
pour a little bit into this canteen. Ah, let, let's take a sip. Hmm. Ah, takes away the edge. Takes away a little bit of the edge. Ah, grab the rest of this stuff. We're going to sell it off. Okay. So let's see what kind of profit we can make. Can we buy... Wow, look at these refugees. Can we buy something? Can we buy a tank? Ah. Good doctor. I need you I need you to step back, sir. We're doing some important work here for, for the United States. All right, we're we're going to try to sell these goods off. Oh, we're down to 13. That's okay. It's okay. 2000. So you can't take a lot of this. You can take that. You can take some raw silk. Ah, perfect. All right. That was about 25. So this is going to be close to 5,000. We need so much food, right? Close to 5,000. Hmm. Close to 6,000. Ah, very good. So this will be 10,000 right there. Beautiful. Okay. So we, we can definitely buy two more tanks. One, two more tanks. All right. And we got some Nord infantry. Let's get some stormtroopers. Machine gunners for sure. Yes, stormtroopers. So let's see. First company, you definitely should be second company. Second company, second company. Yes. All the foreign troops will be second company, except for the tank hunters. And then, of course, the... All of the homegrown troops are in first company. Then we got the tanks. Yes. Okay, we're down to 10,000. I think one more village will do it. And, um... How many tanks? How many tanks do we have now? Well, okay, so we're gonna buy one more tank, guys. And I think we're gonna buy... One more bomber. Yeah, and I think we'll be ready to attack the rim. See you guys in a second. Wow, look at all of these machine tools that we picked up at this second raided village. We're going to have some the money to spare. Well, I've been making a hefty profit indeed. I'm back up to 20000 made 10000 I still haven't sold all these tools. I'm heading over to Ravadin. I'm trying to see if I can get a better price. Because after you sell one tool, I think the price on them goes about down by half. So, let's see if I can get a better... Oh, no. No! <laughs> ah, damn. Swati and spies trying to take out the lieutenant colonel. And what, if there's one more man... Hi there you are, sir! <laughs> Oh, yeah, this is definitely the better machine gun. Oh, oh, th there we go, there we go, there we go. Got you in my sight, sir. Still alive. Are you, are you even close to hitting me, sir? That's the question is, am I even close to hitting you? That's, that's definitely a far range. Ah, uh, yeah, you see, he doesn't even have range on me. Ah, uh, you missed. <laughs> Finally got him. All right. Now, back to Raven and back to what we were doing. Um, let's try to sell these off. Thank you. And see how they went down. That's close enough. That's close enough. Yeah. Alright, we're gonna go to hmm. Well, you know what? Let's let's head over to this territory. We we haven't ventured out that far yet. Like I said, we need all the money we can get. Oh, all of our allies are driving out of the war. It's just us left. No. Alright, let's go to Hadamar. Frank Buckles. Um we don't have time to chat now, sir. I appreciate it, but uh, no time to chat. Alright, let's see if uh if there's anything different here to go walk around the streets. Yes! I like it! Very good. It's, ni it's nice to see a, a different town scene. Well, we made a nice profit. 
on those couple of raids. And I bought a few more tanks. I bought another bomber. Uh, we are good to go. We've got an army that's fairly full. We've got our two companies ready to go. And we're heading to Durell. Th there's no more waiting for it. So let's see. There's probably going to be... I'm sure some Swadians standing between us and Durem, but we're just going to have to figure that out once we get there. Last time I checked Durem, I believe it was a little over 300 men in the garrison, but, but I believe with superior tactics we can do it. Uh-huh, yeah. Okay, so... Oh, wait a minute. Ah, uh, we just walked right past this guy. I'm glad because he's got mainly me mechanized forces, not a lot of um, actual infantry. We got a lot of infantry. All right, let's see. Let's see. Oh, <laughs> wow. That army alone could probably take me out. Oh, they have a lot of tanks. Can't take them on. Oh no 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 no! All right, if if we take them on one at a time, ah, one at a time would work. Let's see. He's got some bombers. He's got some tank hunters. He's got a few tanks. Hmm. Let's get him. Oh uh, no 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 no! Now you're running away, aren't you? The rim is looking worse and worse. What are we gonna do here? I wonder if we could target maybe Suno, Luke's Hall, would be easier. It seems like the rim is is very well protected. All right, let, let's let's head into some. Well, if you men would would stay close by, maybe we could take the rim. All right, let's check out Luke's Hall. It's got to be more favorable. Is it as defended? It is. Yeah, wait. Not so bad. 316. This is looking better. They have some tanks. Oh, and they're getting the hell out of town. This could be extremely dangerous taking Luke's Hall. Hmm. Let's see. Leaves the town. Okay. Guys, we're going to get ready for this. I can't wait. We're going to see Duke's Hall. I know it's not the rim, but um, this is the best we can do. And this will cut right through the middle of their empire. So once we're ready, I'm going to cut right back. See you guys in a second. Congratulations, Cody Ray and Gabriel Stoker. You answered last episode's trivia question correctly. And that question was... What was the longest battle of World War I? And you, amongst others, answered with the battle verb done. So congratulations, all of you, and make sure you stay tuned because we have another trivia question later in this episode. I made sure I put on my sentry helmet. Because this is going to be a rough one. This is going to be a rough one indeed! Okay. There we go. All right. Hold our companies back. We're going to send those tanks in as well. Let's go, companies. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, my goodness. This is looking fantastic. All right, first company, we're going to have them down in the valley. Second company, we're going to have them up on top of this hill. Oh, my goodness. All right, let's bring second company over to this building here. Uh, first company over to that building. Let's go, man. Oh, my goodness. We've already got some planes going down. All right, let's see if we can get over to this building. Best we can. Can we spot the enemy? Oh, yes. There they are. Let's send some artillery shells that way. All right, first company has got a mission. They've got to get over to those buildings. To the left there. All right, second company. Follow me, second company. We're gonna head over to this right-hand side. Try to use these buildings as much for cover as possible. Second company, let's go, let's go. Second company, over this way. 
Alright, first company looks like they've made it over to their first position. We're gonna have them get closer. There we go. First company, move over! To the left, to the left, to those buildings! Oh my god. It's unbelievable. Oh, this is fantastic. Alright, I'm, I'm gonna scout ahead and see what I can find. Good job. Alright, let's bring second company up this way. Oh my goodness. I'll get that. Oh, the bombing seems to be working well. Uh, we've got half of our enemies taken care of. I don't know if there's any more cover up this way. No, there is not. Alright. Um, there's still a line of men. Over in these trenches. What are we looking at here? All right, first company, first company, and first company up to this line. Second company up to this line. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh my goodness, they have a Zeppelin over there too! Alright, we have our men coming in. Alright, we're gonna bring them over to this trench line. First company! Second company! Alright, let's wait till we get our men up to the trench line. Let's gather men, let's gather, let's gather, let's gather. Oh, this is fantastic. This is fantastic! Alright. Let's move forward, man. Let's go, let's go, let's go. All right, first company, let's move forward. This is a perfect spot for you. Oh, no! Uh, I think our tanks have gotten stuck. Let's see if we can bring them down that way. Second company over this way. I guess it, it looks like... Oh, we need our tanks! We desperately need our tanks! I, th I think that they've been bombed out. We may have to just use men. Oh, 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 oh! Okay, I, I, I see them, men. I, I see them. Oh, no. All right, here's what we're going to do. First company, I want you to enter in this way. Second company, you're going to come from the right side. Let's go. Let's go, men. You have your orders. Still got a hundred men. Oh, I don't know if we're gonna do it. I don't know if we're gonna do it. Oh, they are spread throughout. Second company here. First company here. All right, let's send the second company charging in. I'm gonna have the first company hold on me. It's gonna be a, a, a no, no, oh no! This is gonna be a street fight. Oh my goodness! It's definitely a street fight here. All right, we've got a huge concentration of them back there. They're not going to give up this town easily. Come on, man. Let's go. Let's go. Keep searching the streets. Keep searching the streets. All right. There are men over this way. First company. Let's go. Oh, there is a huge mess of them. They, we may have to retreat. I don't know if we've got to take this in one shot. Oh, there they are. Colonel just took a shot to the face. All right, this is this is um possibly promising. Oh, we've got a tank so far back, so far back it may not matter. 
All right, I think what we're going to do, guys, we're going we're gonna to have to retreat this battle. That was something else, wasn't it? Wow. Wow. Okay, Uxal's got 150 left. What are we looking at? Oh, no. 50 men. Hmm. We may have to take care of some business. Let's see. We still got most of our tanks. Okay, okay. We're, we're, we're in good shape. We're, we're in really good shape since we've got most of our tanks... What do they still have? They still have one tank and one armored car. Here's this episode's trivia question. After World War I, four empires collapsed. Can you name those four empires? Make sure you put each of them down in the comment section below. And if you give me the correct answer, if you name all four empires, I may give you a shout out in the next episode. All right, good luck everyone. We're just going to refill our ranks a little bit because, um, hmm. First company and second company got devastated. I, I could do this and refill first company real nice. And then this would um, help second company out. And uh, that would put us in pretty good shape. Now, the only hope is that they haven't refilled. Oh, please, please tell me. Please tell me this. It's not too bad. Oh no! This is a problem. Well, it looks like we've got a lot more work to do if we're gonna take Uxal. I'm gonna have to rebuild my army. We're gonna have to assault it yet again. I know, but we're gonna do that in the next episode. It's not easy going after towns in this mod, and that's what I love. But, but guys, if you enjoyed this episode, make sure you hit that like button. It helps me out so much. The more likes, the more likely this series will continue. Also, if you're not a subscriber yet, hit that subscribe button. Thanks so much for joining me, and I'll see you next time on the Parabellum.